What's going on YouTube? It's Daniel back at it again with a brand new video and today I wanted to show you all how to get uh, hundreds or thousands of likes to any Facebook page with minimal amounts of money like 10, 15, 30, 40. I mean the more you spend obviously the better results you'll have but you can get results hundreds of results with just uh, you know 10, 20 bucks. So before I get into the mechanics and how to do this for your page, I kind of want to talk about just, you know, why you should do this and what are the benefits and kind of the reasoning behind why I think this is a good strategy for any type of business, whether you're like a brick and mortar store or, you know, an online e-commerce site or a doctor with a clinic or, you know, any kind of uh, Facebook page. So... Let's just jump into my computer real quick to talk about this. So to begin with, I want to ask you a simple question. So when you're going onto Facebook, and let, let, actually let me give you an example. Let's say that there's, you know, you have a friend and she's looking to get pictures done. So she looks for, you know, photographers in wherever you live in the area, and she finds four or five that she thinks she wants to use. So what are the things that she looks at on the Facebook page to make her decision? Well, I can guarantee you that one is definitely the amount of likes on the Facebook page. And I know that's a huge factor for a lot of people I know is, you know, if the page has lots of likes, it's social proof, right? It's, you want to go use that page if it has tons of likes. And if it had 40 likes, you'd be like, eh, like, you know, I don't know. Maybe they're just starting or they're not very popular. And if they got a thousand likes, you'll be like, oh, okay, like, you know, they're well established. But at the same time, that'll only work if the page looks up to par with a thousand likes. So kind of what I'm getting at here is likes are super, super, super important. And they social proof your page. So people will want to use your page over others if you have lots of likes. But at the same time, you can't go too overboard with this strategy and have too many likes. Because if you have too many likes and your page isn't up to par, you know, you're not posting content regularly. You know, your page just looks bad with the banner image and the profile image. You're not running ads, stuff like that. Like you have to keep your page up to a certain standard for this to work. But Getting the likes is very easy, very simple, and I'm going to show you how to do that in a minute. And one more thing I wanted to add is this works so well because you can't tell who likes the page, right? You can see a page, and you can see how many followers or likes it has, and how many reviews it has, and what they post, and yada, yada, yada. But you can't see the individuals who like the page. The only time you see if someone likes a page is... If one of your friends that you're friends with, um, that you're friends with on Facebook, follows or likes a page, let's say one of your friends likes, uh, you know, the NFL, the NFL's page, then you know eventually you're probably going to see some some uh, ad in your feed and it's or some post in your feed and it's going to be your friend and it's going to say, you know, you know Blake, blah 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 likes NFL and I'll show a little picture. So then you'll be like, oh, okay, well he liked the NFL page, but if you go to the NFL page, you won't actually see who likes it. So this works so well because you can get likes from different countries to boost the social status of your page. And you can do it extremely cheap because they're so populated and they, they just like things like crazy. It's so much cheaper than trying to get likes in America. But does the same thing for your business because people can't see who likes your stuff, if that makes sense. So without further ado, let's get into this. I'm going to hop into my computer. Okay, so we're in my computer right now. I just opened Facebook and I want to show you guys kind of how to do this for your business. So first things first, you're going to need a page. So let's see here. I did this for this page right here. I'll just kind of give you guys an example. If it'll load for me. Okay, sorry, so we're here now. My internet's just being really slow, so I skipped ahead to the page opened. But let's say you have a page like this, right? Party Ponies, this is just a brand of a product that I sold at one point, and I use this strategy to help drive sales. So 
basically, once you make a page, if you want to learn how to make a page and you don't know how, maybe I'll make a video about that and link it in the description so you can go check the description and see if that's there. Or you can just ask me or, you know, look up a different tutorial. I'm sure there's plenty of them. It's pretty self-explanatory. But say you've made a page, you have a good uh, profile picture, and you have a decent cover photo. So obviously this isn't the best cover photo, but I just use something off Google Images because it you know, wasn't that huge of a deal. And once you're at this stage and you have your page, you'll probably want to... Actually, before you start posting content, you don't even have to start posting content to get the likes. You can get the likes first, and then you can post content to make your page look natural and organic. But to start getting the likes, we'll just go over here to this section. And this will probably be a lot bigger. They'll have a lot more options here for you. And you can go down here to Manage Promotions. So we click that. And as you can see here, this recent ad on Party Ponies that I ran... Uh, it's the same exact thing that I'm showing you guys how to do. I reached six, almost 7,000 people, and I got 1,500 likes almost, and I spent $14. And those are great results, obviously. I don't know what that actually is. Let me actually do the math for you there. 13.99 um, divided by 14.78. So I paid... Uh, 0 0.0095 cents per ad. So I didn't even pay a cent for an ad. I paid almost a penny for or er, for an ad. I, I paid almost a penny for a like. That's extremely, extremely cheap. And as you can see, you could just, you know, get thousands of, of likes for that. And let's actually view the results here and see. Um just like this full summary. All right, so for this ad right here, I targeted men and women ages 18 to 65 who lived in four locations and had one interest. So I targeted people living in India, Nigeria, Philippines, Pakistan, and I had an interest as unicorn. So right, unicorn, party ponies. And that was it. That was all of my, uh, my audience was. So... To show you guys how to do that, let's go to promote, and it'll bring up this page for you. And we're gonna want to do promote your page because we want to get pro, uh, page likes. And we'll click that, and we'll get brought to this. And this will show you. Oh, I have ad blocker on. Hold up, I probably gotta. Um, I'll just leave it. Never mind. Sorry about that. Anyways, so we're in here, uh, single image video, whatever, just leave it as single image. And this, you can just take as your, uh, um, it'll auto put your banner photo on, but we can just kind of crop it, make it look better. Click done. So you can just totally leave that. It's really not that big of a deal. And the text, you can, you can literally put anything you want. Uh, we could put something like, like our, uh, let's say, like unicorns, then you'll love our Facebook page, Party Ponies. You know, some, literally, it could be whatever you want. This works so easily. It's not even, like, I can't even lie to you how easily this works. So we'll leave that like that. And then this is the only thing that really matters right here. So it'll probably preset your uh, audience to the location where you live. And we want to get rid of that because those likes will cost too much. And we want to add highly populated areas like India. So we'll add India. We can add Nigeria. I don't remember what I had in the previous one. It was Pakistan. And we could just leave it like that. That's totally fine. Just three places. And then if they have a if there's a specific, you know, interest that you think a broad interest that would just boost the likelihood of them liking your page. So if your page is uh 
you know, let's say about makeup or something, we could do makeup and we don't want employers, um, makeup tutorials, you know, whatever the heck you want to do, something about makeup, uh, potential reach 210,000, so that might be a little too narrow, but we could add more countries, but you get the idea. We could put an interest in here if that is something that would, I suggest putting it in. It'll help narrow the audience a bit more. So to recap, go to promote, fill out your picture and your text, go here. You can just leave this as this, unless you want to change this, you can add highly populated countries, India, Nigeria, Pakistan, all those work. You can use them if you want. And then add an interest. Don't you want, see how this is 320 million? That's fine. We can throw in the one thing to make it a little bit more narrow. It really doesn't matter. It could be, you, you know, you're even 200,000 people like we had before is still a lot of people. You're, you know, if you had 210,000 likes, that'd be ridiculous. You don't need that many on your page. So the audience size can be narrowed down a lot. So if you want to dive in, make it more uh, specific to your page, then totally fine to do that. Or you can just leave it like this. It'll still work. But the more diligence, the more discipline you have in this uh, area right here with interests and behaviors, obviously the less you'll probably have to pay for a like. But again, even just leaving it like this, you'll still pay cents for a, a like. So it's really not that big of a deal. And then we'll run down here. Daily budget. So whatever your budget is, you know, if you got 20, say you have $35, $5 a day. So you just say five bucks a day, seven days, run it for, you'll spend 35. Uh, pick your account that you want to bill and your card and everything looks good. So then we click promote and I'm not going to do it because I don't want to uh, actually run this because I'm not using this page anymore. And normally this would show right here. This picture would be over here and it would show the ad, but I have ad blocker on, so it's not popping up. So that's why it doesn't show. But yeah, so you just fill all that out like I showed you, click promote and let it run. And I promise you, if you do that, you will get thousands of likes to your page in a matter of a few days. And it's it seems like it's too good to be true, but it's really easy. And it'll social proof your page, help you get more business, as long as you keep your page up to par with the standards. You know, if you have a thousand likes, you got to make sure it's looking good. It's looking believable. But other than that, that is the strategy I wanted to show you guys today. Hopefully that helps you. If it did help you, please leave a like or leave a comment. It would really help me out if you did that. And if you have any questions about the strategy or, or any other digital marketing strategies, just leave a comment below and I'll make sure to get to you ASAP. Also, I just wanted to quickly mention that I am sorry for not posting on here in forever. I've been very busy with lots of things and I've been doing a lot of uh, social media marketing and uh, SEO and stuff for companies. I have a few different companies I'm working with on that stuff and I want to make this channel really focused on digital marketing as a whole. So I'm going to be posting videos on here every week probably more than once a week if I can keep up with the schedule. So yeah, that's the plan. Subscribe if you're interested in that stuff and I will see you all in the next video. Peace. I love